Hi everybody and welcome to another Google Hangout here. It's Glenn Dietzel here and we're going to uh, be talking today about on our business breakthrough Google Hangout on how to command maximum fees and royalties um, with your coaching company. Um, I've had an opportunity over the last uh, uh, little while, well actually over the last 12 years to establish a vetting process uh, for um, entrepreneurs who are interested in working with my company and one of the best things that I've done in business is to set up a vetting process um, allow people to take a look at what we do um, so they can educate themselves on why what I'm going to cover today is so absolutely crucial that you understand if you are in the coaching consulting high-end training uh, business um, so you want to pay uh, particular attention. You're probably going to want to take some notes. Um, definitely probably want to jot down some diagrams um, because I'm going to be showing you uh, some diagrams today so I can really make a point for you. Um, many times I draw things out for you or I draw um, literally post things so you can see. Um, today I'm going to do things a little bit differently because I really want you to see uh, the power of what I'm talking about. In today's marketplace, it's absolutely paramount that you know how to position high-end programs and services. Um, right now, I'm going. In, I've just created a um, a process whereby we have several hundred people who have applied for one-on-one -on -one coaching directly with me, and it's really important that you have processes and that you have systems so that you can maintain high touch um, with your own clients and know how to. Um, use your own time effectively and one of the biggest mistakes that I see people making in business today um, is um, is the failure to invest in themselves and I know there's a lot of hype online I, I get it and I know that people have been burned in coaching before I get it um, I've invested over three hundred and fifty thousand dollars in coaching and consulting one thing that I don't get though and it's always been intuitively obvious for me is even from the first days of starting my own business is paying for investing in coaching and consulting um, I see a lot of people that want to sell high-end programs and services but if they've never made and you've never made a significant investment in your company how do you expect others to want to make an investment with you and that's kind of the catch-22 isn't it um, how do you grow your company make speed your competitive advantage um, we all want to make intelligent investments right in our business um, and it seems to me that uh, it just seems to me in, in, intuitively obvious that if you want to grow your company you're going to want to hire the best um, you can do it the slow way and hire and try to figure things out yourself and I'm going to show you a model today that I highly advocate for you um, so that you don't trade time for money and so that you command maximum fees for your advice and I can tell you um, categorically that those people who fail to invest in their businesses and in themselves they simply don't act quick enough I can tell you that categorically my best clients are the clients that have invested significantly in themselves in their businesses because they want to leverage um, the systems that I've created um, and help them implement those within their own business and help them execute and that's what everything is about today is assistance with execution and so I want to if you're new to our Google Hangouts today I want to welcome you uh, with open arms um, live from our international office here in Canada um, we do have clients that come in all over the world into the Canadian Lake Home one of our residences here in Canada and um, looking forward to a um, our next uh, event that we're doing our one-day business acceleration intensive and um, you can call our company if you'd like to pl be placed on the notification list for that um, our Omega my members who are coming in very shortly again and also my one-on-one -on -one clients that fly in all over the world meet my um, family and uh, if you've been following us on Facebook or G plus 
Um, you will have met my oldest son, who uh, did a video um, uh, on behalf, I guess, of my company. Um, I didn't realize what he was doing, but uh, posted it for us um, on my account, and it gives you a chance to meet uh, my family um, before you come in, uh, those of you that uh, have made a wise decision and uh, invested in our programs and our services. I lead today with my track record because after all, that's all we all have, right, is our track record. And um, I've had an opportunity to speak with some very bright people all around the world and I get that you are cynical. Um, I get that you're probably a little bit jaded. Um, I get that because I am too. We've all been hyped to the nth degree um, and the new equalizer in today's marketplace, and this is great news if you're newer in business and you're in startup mode, but the great, great equalizer today is knowing how to deliver great education and uh, knowing how to help others get the kind of results that they want. And my clients want results, that's what they invest in, and that's what I'm here for, to assist you if you're new to our programs, um, those of you that are uh, currently uh, being vetted directly by me gives you a chance again to meet me and uh, I'm excited about that. I'm excited about the high touch that we provide our clients. I'm really excited about the new edition of Lifestyle Entrepreneur Magazine that's coming out um, this week, uh, tomorrow or Wednesday. will be live our next edition and will be coming out every month um, but our April issue uh, is coming out uh, this week. Um, of Lifestyle Entrepreneur Magazine. You're going to love it. Um, if you've not uh, downloaded it yet, um, you still have can get the, uh, the link to the our February issue. Our March issue uh, got derailed a little bit uh, because of my time away uh, for vacation uh, with my clients. And now we're back onto a monthly regular schedule. So our April issue is coming out and uh, really look forward uh, um, uh, to... Um, helping you and assisting you build the kind of business that you really want. Um, one thing that I can tell you today is that most people that are in the market that are around teaching high-end programs and services, all they really are is motivational speakers. Um, they're very good at getting people to develop a little bit of confidence in themselves, but at the end of the day, people are left still, how do I execute? What are the best steps? What's the best business model do I implement? How do I create my competitive advantage? Glenn, I get that I need to have a five, ten, fifteen, fifty thousand dollar high-end program. How do I put it together? How do I deliver it so that I'm not trading time for money? How do I sell it so I don't have to sound salesy and feel just yucky? And uh, a lot of our clients invest in our programs because that's the kind of problems that they have and uh, they want to be able to get daily assistance with me and my company and uh, they want direct assistance in building their presentations to close deals and just creating a better business model. So I'm going to talk to you today. I'm going to disappear a little bit uh, today because I've got a lot that I want to show you and uh, it's taken me a long time to develop these kinds of systems so that when clients, uh, people like yourself, make the uh, intelligent decision to invest with my company, they know that we've got proven and measurable systems to help them execute immediately. And that's the name of the game today. As I, if you've been following us and, uh, you know, we have a few positions available uh, for one-on-one -on -one mentoring and I've got a huge queue of people uh, who've applied and I'm humbled. Um, if you haven't heard from me um, yet, it's because we're uh, going through uh, everything and uh, going through all the applications. But as I said in an email just recently, if you are a um, small fish, this is great news for you. If you are a slow fish, it's horrible news for you today. Because no longer is it the big that eats the small, it's the fast that eats the slow. And so many great people that I meet globally make the fundamental mistake that they think that executing on their own is going to give them the kind of competitive advantage where speed is crucial and they fail to really understand the importance that in today's marketplace, it's about speed. Speed needs to be your competitive advantage.
So you need to know how to execute faster. You need to know how to focus differently than what your competitors are doing. And I get it. I get that you're probably a little bit scared. I get that um, we all at some point lack the confidence to execute as fast as we want or we want to play a little bit safer. In the end of the day, we just end up losing market share. And somebody else who's faster and quicker is going to take your ideas, outright steal them, or they're going to massage them and implement faster than what you can. So you've got to be highly strategic today. So when it comes to commanding high-end fees for your advice um, and building royalties, I want to uh, share with you um, a couple of uh, a few fundamental principles and take you through a three-step system today. And also, I want to start, though, by looking at a very popular model that just about every big seminar name does today. And if you were in a live one-day intensive with me, I would ask, field the audience, um, and I'm going to show you a few pictures of my recent uh, one-day intensive here uh, shortly. But I would ask the audience uh, who comes in, and I don't do seminars, I don't do conferences, I do one-day business acceleration events for, where people come in, great entrepreneurs all over the world, and gives them a chance to look at their businesses for an entire day through the lens of how I execute and what I teach my clients and how we convert people at almost, that come through our funnels at almost 100% um, into our high-end programs and services <coughs> and gives them a chance to look at their own businesses um, with a whole new set of eyes, okay? So if you want to have a quantum leap, you've got to have a new set of eyes on looking at your business today. So I want us to step back here for a second. If we think about the top seminar leaders, producers, um, you know, you could probably, you know, rhyme out a few names. So together we're here. But I want to show you what most of them do here. So I'm going to disappear here for a couple minutes and I'm going to be back. And most people that are in the seminar business to build a seven-figure seminar business, they market to the masses. And uh, right here you can see, uh, you know, there's a ton of people that uh, they go in, they either do this by city um, or they do this by country. And they market to the masses. And I'm telling you right now that there is a better way that doesn't require you to make a huge huge investment like these seminar companies do um, and you probably know many of the names if we used their names right now they spend millions of dollars having tons of people um, doing the legwork for them orchestrating everything behind the scenes and putting on these huge events instead what if there were a better way where you could teach your marketplace to self-select themselves for your highest end programs and services? So you're only attracting the best kind of clients. All right. And so what we're talking about is a strategic way of educating your marketplace. Educating your marketplace so that you can build, if you're just starting out or scaling, in the position of a coach, an expert, or an advisor. And that's what we're going to talk a little bit about today, around how do you put together systems to build the kind of following that doesn't require the huge outlay of money and people that you need to hire to run these mega events. And what if you could do them a lot more profitably, attract the kinds of clients that you want globally that are investing in programs, your highest end programs and services that run $25,000 and $50,000 and higher. And what if you had a model that allowed you and positioned you not just as a coach, an expert, or an advisor, but a coach's coach, an expert's expert, or an advisor's advisor. So I want you to write that down. In today's marketplace, you need to know how to position yourself even one step higher as the coach's coach, the expert's expert, the consultants and consultants, or the advisor's advisor. And I'm going to show you what I have done to position myself in this, in this role. And I haven't done this, if you will, um, in a way that... I'm doing this to, to say, hey, you know, look at how great I am. I'm on the top and, and all of that. 
I created this system because I've been in the marketplace longer than just about anybody that I know, mastering um, the coaching and consulting industry, consulting to some of the world's experts, people that you would know um, that are that have high-end programs and services today, and that are running a company, a business, a full-fledged business, not a you know having a coaching job or a consulting job but having a full-fledged company because they know how to build a company. And coaching and consulting and training is highly rewarding if you have a great model that allows you to build the kind of, of ROIT business, return on invested time. So what I'm going to talk to you today is about not using what typical experts, gurus use today, and you've probably been to some of their events, um, where they've got hundreds of people and behind the scenes they've spent millions of dollars to fill the room and then they're going to pitch a high-end program or service and all there are really at the end of the day is just helping develop a little bit of confidence but there's no assistance with execution and that's not what my clients want I'll tell you that and you probably don't want it either and that's not the kind of company that I've built um, so we need to know how to deliver high touch and, and we need to know how to build a better model that allows you to command high fees by attracting the right kinds of clients don't require that huge outlay of money and huge outlay of time and hiring people and if you want to think differently you need a better business model to work from okay so you're getting it I'm going to um, uh, take you uh, through something here that's absolutely crucial that uh, you see and I uh, want to focus with you on commanding maximum fees and royalties for high priced programs. All right. So what I want to do first of all though, so you see this model and I, you've, and I want you to see this, you probably want to jot down um, a few graphs here that I'm showing you. But if we take a look at a cash flow versus time graph, and I'm all about cash flow. You know, my father's a retired CPA. Um, my clients invest in our programs because they want to accelerate cash flow. And the tip, the problem is that most experts and gurus teach a model that really, at the end of the day, only produces linear growth. You know, given as I'm showing you here by the red line, and at some point here on our time graph there's enough cash flow generated if if companies stay in business long enough and most of them don't to reach the level of profitability in fact in today's coaching industry probably uh, statistically almost 95 percent of coaches fail to become profitable with their businesses so they can actually begin to grow a company almost 95 percent of coaches and consultants in other words are struggling alright so we need a better model here and that's why I love the accelerated model right here and if we took a point on our acceleration line and we took a point on and where we hit profitability here versus profitability here on the linear growth line which most experts and gurus are teaching the difference between that in our on our time graph here cash flow versus time is what I call speed to market speed to market alright so I want to make the first point here that in a in a coaching model that's going to leverage royalties and commanding high-end prices you need to be able to leverage speed to market all right so we're going to I want to take a look now here and take a look at a um, build from our speed to market uh, graph here and highlight here that this is the danger zone right here is focusing where most experts and gurus will have you and especially uh, people who are building coaching consulting and training industries are in the red zone or the red sector as opposed to leveraging the yellow sector all right so if we take the same graph we're still on our cash flow versus time graph and we take a look at the typical expert platform versus the new guru platform there is a way of what we call inverting the business funnel 
and beginning where you're not starting off with zero cash flow, but you're starting with cash flow immediately with your business. And it's possible to do that if you know how to invert your business funnel and you know how to educate your marketplace to select your highest end programs and services. So if we take a point here on the linear line versus our new accelerated line, any point, any point differential between those two lines is what I call educate to dominate. All right. So you need to have a process that allows you to educate to dominate. Now, I want to stress further, it's absolutely crucial in today's marketplace if you want to succeed in business, coaching and consulting, your tra a training company, you need to get off this line of profitability as fast as possible. And so I call that creating a moat. And a moat is possible. It's possible to create a moat or a competitive advantage that literally insulates yourself from competition. And so that line uh, there, we'll call that moat, um, that's one zone or one sector. And this is another sector right up here now. And I want, to, you, I want to stress to you that you want to place your attention in this area right here and in this area right here and away from this area over here. <clears throat> and yet I have so many, I talk to so many well-meaning entrepreneurs, coaches and consultants that want to start on their own or build something on their own and then make an investment in their company when they're building and completely focused in the wrong area in business. So I call this the competitive advantage zones. The competitive advantage zones are your money sector areas, all right? They are the accelerated area in business and knowing how to create a moat for your business. And that's what I want to talk to you about so that you know how to create um, premium prices for your, or charge premium prices for your services and also build um, royalty revenues with your um, with your advice. All right. So let me um, come back here for a second. I trust that you're following me. If we can just quickly recap, you've got to have speed to market. Um, so that's got to become part of your competitive advantage. You've got to know how to educate to dominate in your marketplace. So it's knowing about what it is that you give away very strategically to your marketplace so you become a person a trusted advisor and if you do it right you can become more than just a coach you can become more than just a consultant an expert or an advisor you can become as I showed you you could become the coaches coach or the experts expert or the consultants consultant um, if you do it strategically all right and most importantly you can position yourself at the very highest levels in your industry like I have if you follow better business systems all right it is all about having better business systems that allow you to get more time back that allow you to execute a lot more strategically where you're educating the dominating in your marketplace and you're accelerating in speed to market fashion so you want to leverage those competitive advantage zones that I talked about okay and that I showed you all right so I'm going to uh, move forward here and I want to just make sure that you understand that the traditional business funnel here and you've probably seen this before um, I'm huge on teaching clients why they shouldn't be using the traditional business funnel this model makes zero sense in today's trusted advisory age the funnels too long there's at least a 50 percent return rate at each level it's more like 70 to 80 percent there's a 70 percent loss at each level that means that a hundred people that invest in your twenty seven dollar program only fifteen people will move to the next level only three people will move to the next level after that and only one person will move to the next level after that and if you do the math that means that you make on average twenty eight dollars and eighty one cents per customer this is why this is what I ref why I refer to this model as the poor person's business model the problems are you lose speed to market you immediately lose market share forever your market dwindles at each level and you have an incredibly small chance of making a sale alright so I want to make sure that you understand that in today's marketplace you want 
to leverage the inverted business funnel. You want to flip the funnel. You will, and that's why it's so crucial on how you educate your marketplace. That's why my clients love what we teach them and invest in our programs because they understand that they've got to make speed their competitive advantage. It's crucial that they know how to educate their market. It's crucial that they know how to build their, your competitive advantage um, and build your competitive intelligence that allows you not only to create a moat in your industry, but it allows you how to execute. And never have I seen so many people today, so many great entrepreneurs, um, and because we attract a lot of great entrepreneurs that are simply stuck. Stuck because they don't know what the next step is in business to execute. And so many well-meaning people today are overthinking. So I want to help you overthink. Stop overthinking. Um, conservatively, I'll tell you that overthinking cost me just about $3 million. Um, conservatively, in my own business, just throwing money out the window because of overthinking. So I want to help you over stop overthinking. And uh, so I want to uh, take a look here and give you my number one positioning strategy. Um, in today's marketplace. You want to make your mark in your industry and you want to make it in a big way. It's either play big or go home. So the key is in building a massive world-class advisory based coaching consulting training company where your position as the coach's coach, the advisor's advisor, the consultant's consultant, the expert's expert is to become part of their business that needs to be in place in order to operate. So your best strategy is this. You want to make sure that you justify your existence to your potential clients. You want to make sure that you paint an innovative and bright future. You want to base all of your pricing on value times strategic positioning times ROI. So everything in, in, in knowing how to price what it is that you do comes down to how you create value, how you strategically position yourself, and how you build ROI for your clients. And that all begins by having a better way to digest content. That's crucial. Okay, you want to make sure that you're writing this down. Getting your target market to digest content is absolutely crucial. And that's why I'm such a huge believer and uh, um, proponent of coaching and co-branding. So you never have to sell you can build your company very strategically by leveraging a scalable IP plus the right systems will allow you to create recurring monthly income, high-end income, and an attractive asset to sell your company. So if we take a look at um, our coaching and co-branding model, I'm going to uh, take you through here um, the three steps here um, in just a moment. I want you to make sure that you understand that um, it's important and crucial and hugely crucial that how you think and it is crucial to how you execute. How you think is crucial to how you execute. So um, one of the mantras in education that I come out of is that you know, there's a, um, a presupposition that um, students see something already and that you take what students see and you build on that. And I totally disagree with that. I disagree with that at so many different levels. I believe that you can only see what you know. You can only see what you know. And people can't see something if they don't know about it. All right, so I'm going to take you through something that I want to help re-engineer your thinking. So if I can help you re-engineer your thinking, you're going to begin to better execute in business. All right, so I want to take you through three a uh, three-step process <coughs> around re-engineering, reconstituting your thinking, so that you build from a more intelligent business model. Because so many people today are are doing um, all kinds of activities. I mean, I have never seen more people who um, I'm vetting for our programs who are doing so many things, um, and yet I, I see this and I'm just thinking like, 
wow, you know, you're just you're doing some good things, but they're not the things that you should be doing in business, especially in the marketplace today. And that's why I started by saying there's got to be a better way of attracting your ideal clients. And there's got to be a more intelligent business model where you're not just positioning yourself as a coach or an expert or an advisor <coughs> or a consultant, but you're, you're positioning yourself one step higher in the marketplace. And so if you want that kind of positioning and you know that that brings you a whole new level of influence, not just in your marketplace, but with the media, um, with event organizers that maybe want you to, to get on their summits or speak at their events or their universities um, or their business conferences or their Google Hangouts or whatever. You've got to be strategically positioned completely differently than your competitors. Because remember, greater sameness won't get you better results. Greater sameness won't get you better results. One of our speed to market principles. So let me uh, help you um, re-engineer some of your thinking, all right? So that um, this will, I hope and I trust, make uh, perfect sense uh, to you. So let's first of all start with step one. In our coaching and co-branding model, first step that is crucial in business is to create leveraged profits. Leveraged profits. So that means by starting and building your competitive intelligence differently than what your competitors are doing. So if you're writing a book right now, putting another free report together, <coughs> or you're putting a, a DVD, or you're getting ready for a television appearance, or whatever it is, I want to um, tell you this right now that unless you know how to build your competitive intelligence very strategically all the effort that you're putting into business is not going to create leverage for yourself so that starts by accelerating within a speed to market system that's always focusing on if you're new in business in startup mode creating your very first profitable transaction getting over that Dot, dotted red line of profitability that I showed you earlier and focusing on increasing the size and number of transactions. All right, and that's the power of our coaching and co-branding model. It's the power of our mastermind monetizer model and helping clients really build a true business acceleration within their business. So in order to do that then, you want to focus on the five core areas of business. And there's only five core areas of business that you should be focusing on. Value creation, value delivery, marketing, sales, and you must have high profit margins. All right? So I trust that you're getting this. And as I show you step number two here, I want to stress to you the importance of everything is built on previous positioning as I'm working with a client. So I want you to see that we never lose sight of increasing the size and number of transactions because business is about cash flow. It's about increasing your profit margins. You know, Marcus Buckingham and Kirk Kaufman, two uh, really popular New York Times best-selling authors, said something a few years ago and it was great for them to say something that I've been teaching for the last 12 years that in order to survive in today's marketplace entrepreneurs must have high-end programs and services and they must know how to leverage their clients alright and that's why I'm a, I love our our certificate our um, coaching and co-branding program and our mastermind monetizer model because it allows you to build cash flow and it allows you to leverage your clients. The coaches and the trainers and the consultants and the experts and the advisors that you attract in your marketplace. So let's take a look now, building off of step number one here. We're going to move into step two. So from our, and this, so let's just quickly focus again or recap here. Uh, step number one, we're focusing on value creation, value delivery, marketing, sales, and having high profit margins, right? Step number two then, we take these five core areas in business as we're growing our company, and we're now gonna make sure that we insulate ourselves by creating a moat, okay? And the best way that I know how to leverage a coaching and co-branding business is to build seven critical systems, and my clients can do this literally within a week, build the right kinds of systems, 
that really allow them to build and leverage what we've already created in step one, building from a better business model. So in order to really control your market and build a moat, you want to create the rules for your industry. Okay, So we're going to create a certification process or a high-end training uh, division within your company that's going to build around seven critical systems using a better business model having a client vetting process, um, leveraging a client intake system, um, leveraging a client service process, leveraging a client management system, leveraging strategic vendors, and having accelerated teaching and learning systems. Remember what I said? It's absolutely crucial that you get your target market, your potential clients to consume your content faster. So you got to you've got to know how to build accelerated teaching and learning systems into your coaching consulting and training company all right so step number 2 then we take those seven systems we build from that and now we've got the right kind of leverage to build into and leverage step number three. And that's why I've drawn out the inverted business funnel even bigger in step number three now we move into um, royalty revenues. This is where the real excitement happens in business, everybody. My clients, when this start ha when this starts happening, <coughs> and you've met many of them that I've interviewed, this is when all everything pays off. Pay, you know, business pays off for my clients right from step number one, right closing, closing high end um, business transactions and more of them. But business really pays off when you start having royalty revenues that come in in an dependable nature every single month. And not only that, <coughs> but you create for yourself revenues when people, when your clients, when your coaches, when your consultants, when your trainers use your systems with their clients, you are also creating um, a royalty revenue from that. So my clients love the system because they learn how to sell high-end training and certification programs for fifteen to twenty thousand dollars and they build a co-branding relationship that allows them to create a monthly dependable monthly royalty. Um, they build um, not only do they have high-end programs and services but now they also have high-end certification programs that leverage the multi-million dollar training uh, industry that we're in by creating a co-branding relationship with their clients, with other coaches, with other trainers that allow them to get into new marketplaces quickly and easily. So you're leveraging your authority and your credibility through your clients and other coaches and other trainers who are bringing you into new marketplaces really quickly. And this is how you achieve maximum valuation and cash flow. So why should you have a certification program? Well, let me just uh, quickly uh, come back here for a second. <coughs> and I'm still getting over a little bit over the, uh, the cold that I was plagued with last week. I disappeared, if you remember, last week for a little bit uh, to grab a glass of water uh, or to uh, get a sip of coffee. I've also got my uh, water bottle here. Um, drink tons of water. And of course, uh, I'm a huge believer in closing deals over a cup of coffee. Um, it's even better when you can do it um, from any Starbucks in the world um, and truly build a lifestyle business. But um, I just wanted to quickly summarize. So we covered three steps, um, three strategic steps around um, thinking about how to organize your advice, um, how to become a lot more valuable by um, beginning with the end in mind and that's beginning with royalties and so if you want to build royalties you want to do something that nobody else is teaching or doing in the marketplace today and that's building a co-branding uh, company um, where people where you get to uh, your clients and coaches and trainers and consultants get to leverage your authority and your credibility in their marketplaces and pay you not only a monthly royalty for ongoing access and the right to access your systems but every time they use any of your intellectual property <coughs> excuse me they're using or they're paying you also another stream 
uh, of royalty revenue. So highly strategic. Um, let me just uh, summarize here then the power of the system um, for your business. And I uh, want to uh, highlight here, uh, whoops, um, <laughs> sorry about that. Uh, highlight here a few uh, um, concluding thoughts. So why should you have a certification program? Profits lie deep, not on the surface. You need to realize that. This is the advisory era. If this is the advisory era, you want to position yourself as more than just an expert, more than just a guru. You want to increase the financial power of your advice. My question to you is, what are you doing to increase the financial power of your advice? And this is the gateway to the toll position in your marketplace where you create the rules. And what are the benefits then of coaching and co-branding? It's a huge positioning strategy if you do it right. You get to leverage an entrepreneurial certification process. It's one of the best ways to protect yourself from competition and truly build a moat in your industry because you're creating the rules. It's the fastest way into new marketplaces where you get to leverage your clients and other coaches and other trainers and other consultants and other advisors and other experts who you are attracting because you've got the positioning power in your marketplace. You get to ride a huge tsunami sized trend and it's the perfect way to organize your advice into premium priced programs and services. So the name of the game today is in creating leverage. Creating the rules for your industry like we talked about in, in step number two, where you've got a high-end certification and training company, and then leveraging step number three, where you're making smart money through certification and ridiculous money through co-branding because you get to deal the rules. And we've highlighted this in our certification and co-branding manifesto and where we've also provided you uh, a lot of education on creating a co-branding um, arrangement um, in your industry. So in essence what we're talking about then is creating your own private white label coaching, consulting, advisory, training uh, company in your industry. Highly strategic. It's not, from, uh, it's not licensing. Um, because in you don't want a license, especially if you have any kind of service component attached to it because um, the FTC will view you as a, uh, as a franchise and it's not franchising and I can tell you all kinds of reasons why I don't believe in franchising for coaching, consulting, training, um, and building that kind of a company. Uh, nobody makes any money other than the people that, that create the franchise. Um, so. I'll tell you right now that it, uh, it's a perfect ripoff uh, for you if you're interested in building your own company um, and leveraging um, your intellectual property where you're allowing your own clients to build their own company and uh, having a long-term play with them. And that's why my clients love our programs because they get to leverage my authority and my credibility in their marketplaces, which makes them only more valuable, which makes it a lot easier for them to charge high-end uh, dollars for their training. So I want to uh, summarize what we covered today. If you want to position and you understand that it's absolutely crucial to have high-end programs and services, and you realize that you're probably undervaluing your advice, and I see that across um, entrepreneurs who are in startup mode to entrepreneurs and I've had two clients that have been billionaires um, who struggle with positioning their advice and and positioning high-end programs and services. Um, my clients want to do it in the most ethical way. They don't want to sound salesy or pitchy. Uh, they don't want to be in a position of weakness. They don't want to give away their advice for free and they're tired of people undervaluing their advice and if that's you you want to think a lot more strategically around how you build speed in the marketplace and just giving around willy-nilly free information is not giving you speed and it's certainly not a strategic way of educating your marketplace. So we started off by the two fundamental principles of speed to market, educate to dominate. I talked to you today about knowing how to um, build your competitive intelligence uh, by focusing on the critical 
money sectors that we talked about, building your competitive advantage around the accelerated sector and the sector that's going to give you a moat above the line of profitability. And then I took you through a three-step system to help get you thinking more strategically around how do you position high-end programs and services. And what if you had your own coaching and co-branding program or you were able to leverage our Mastermind Monetizer program to position a high-end program and service and get your target market to consume your content a lot faster, a lot more strategically where they wanted to invest in your highest end programs and services. And so I took you through a three-step process around how to begin to rethink so that you have um, a better understanding, a more intelligent business model to command high-end fees and also command um, top dollar for your royal for royalty revenues. Now, one of our really cool models that we like, that I like, is um, here, and I'm going to uh, take you here through this. Whoops, <laughs> I'm back here. Sorry. Um, let me just uh, share my screen here again with you. Um, and uh, this is a. Uh, whoops. Let me. Uh, um, let's go back here. Uh, <laughs> Um, let me just go back here where we uh, started off here and positioning yourself, um, uh, being the coach's coach, the expert's expert, the advisor's advisor. Um, this is a uh, system here that I'm going to, uh, let me just uh, um, see if I can uh, find it here. Here we go. Um, I want to uh, show you, um, uh, this was one of our uh, recent one-day business intensives that I did at the Vegas Sandcastle. We were completely sold out um, uh, for our one-day intensive. Um, that is, uh, just to see if I can share here another picture with you here. Um, we had a, a great day. Um, um, and clients love and people, this is part of our my vetting process here for our pros, our programs. Um, this is a picture of me here. You can see here at the front, um, there's uh, Justin Sachs, uh, Jeff Mills, and for those of you that have been online, uh, Sylvia Becker-Hill. We've got some just amazing entrepreneurs here. Uh, Jocelyn uh, here. Um, these are some of the people here who have invested in our Omega Mind program and our one-on-one uh, coaching. Um, and I like doing one-day business intensives. I love uh, teaching and showing people my systems where they get the chance to, to come in and make um, and really focus on their business. And that's why I like our Google Hangouts. Uh, it gives you an opportunity to meet me. It gives me a chance to show you um, what makes our company completely different than just about anything that I've seen, and I know this industry very, very well. Um, some of the biggest names in coaching and consulting have hired out my company um, uh, to help them rebuild their business back ends. And uh, I love what I do, and I want to help you love what you do even more by using a better business model. So um, that brings us to the, uh, our, the end today. If you uh, haven't yet downloaded um, or had access to uh, whoops, our... Um, um, whoop. <laughs> uh, let me just uh, see if I can get this here. Uh, if you don't have yet our um, manifesto, let me just uh, put this back on here for you. Uh, you can go to newgurumodel.com forward slash manifesto. Um, you can get the uh, our certification co-branding manifesto, which is the future of coaching and consulting. Um, so uh, that would be my uh, recommendation to you. And uh, for those of you that are in the process of going through um, the vetting process uh, to work directly with me, um, I look forward uh, to uh, meeting you. I uh, look forward to talking with you directly. And um, it, uh, it, it doesn't cease to amaze my wife how we seem to attract just the best entrepreneurs all over the world, people that will fly into the Canadian Lake Home to work directly with me. We'll fly to Vegas uh, for our one-day business intensives, depending on where I do them in the world. And um, uh, I'm honored. And uh, for those of you that have just joined our programs, uh, 
uh, made an intelligent investment in uh, Omega Mind. Uh, really look forward to working uh, with you, and uh, you are going to love um, what you are able to implement. Uh, with my assistance. So, anyways, I look forward to our next uh, Google Hangout together. If we can be a further assistance to you, uh, don't hesitate to phone our international office at 519 542 3043, and you can uh, get the manifesto here, newgurumodel.com forward slash manifesto. And I'm really excited, as I said at the beginning, about uh, the new issue of uh, Lifestyle Entrepreneur Magazine coming out this week, our uh, April issue. So, anyways, look forward. I'll see you on our next Google Hangout. Have a great one, everyone.